Heap the Keeps has developed a workplace program at uh, Brookfield New World Tauranga. Many of the staff have lost uh, fairly significant amounts of weight. So this is how much weight I've lost with Eat the Keeps. I've learned some really good food and life skills. It's not about going hungry. I can actually eat more now that I know what I can eat. Since being on the program I've learnt that. A year ago when I first had the opportunity looking at the Eat for Keeps program um, made some really big changes um, and for me it was it's not about the weight on the scale it's about your inner health and well-being. Now what they've learnt is the physiology, the simple physiology behind that. Lots of protein. Oh it keeps me full and plenty of energy for the day. Now that means they know their way around the supermarket, they know how to shop here, they know how to make the right food choices. Uh, well, well, my eating habits is one of the ones I've changed and it's been easy, you know. Eat for Keats is very simple. Because it really doesn't feel like a diet plan. You know, eating healthier and being healthier. It's been uh, a very good success story for our people that have taken it on board. And in terms of uh, an employer, these employees, they have uh, less downtime in terms of sick days off and uh, they are generally more alert and more productive in their workplaces. Yes, absolutely. Well, we all know that health and well-being is you know, hugely important to all of us. If we can um, offer them some consultation and, and provide some tools for them to, to make some changes personally, um, it's, it's, a, it's a great fit with our people. Um, I was 115.7 k's and I'm sitting around 90 kilos at the moment. And so when, when I first started um, running, I couldn't even do 450 metres, like a normal running around the running track. So I got onto a program, so now I'm running um, uh, three times a week, average seven to eight k's at a time. And the maximum I've done so far, I think is about 18 k's in one go within an hour, hour and 10, hour and 20, you know, so um, fitness side is huge at the moment, so yeah, it's, it's been good. This is the one. Eating the right nuts, eating oh, the right oaks. cereals, wow. eating the right yeah. breads. These are the, the king of cereals, right? Yeah, yeah. You look at the other diets and, and you read all these books and it's all to do with quantities and qualities and you know, not too much of this and not too much of that and counting, you know, so I haven't really bothered um, going on any other diets, but this just seems simple to me. I don't know why, it just seemed easy. And this here is what I used to eat. Ah. So you can throw a few bit of rolled oats into this, throw some yogurt and throw some milk in. The reason I'm so passionate about this is that on a day to day basis I'm seeing lots of people who are overweight, obese, uh, the ones with diabetes are having serious circulation problems, a lot of them are losing limbs, they're having blindness becomes a real issue, they have strokes and just general medical mayhem. That's a key part of it, um, you know, being overweight you could quite easily be a candidate for diabetes and that is somewhere where I don't want to be. So I've lost 31 kilos, the energy levels I feel, the focus, uh, my work life, my home life, um, and what I generally achieve is, is a lot better, and that's just down to diet and exercise. Um, you make sure you rotate it and the improved output that you get from fitter, healthier staff is huge. The biggest factor that I notice is the general confidence levels and, um, and how proud they are of what they've achieved and how e much easier they can do stuff. Um, you know, I go to the gym three or four times a week, I keep very active anyway, um, but I've got energy to burn, um, yeah, just, and, and I'm sure it's because of what I choose to eat now. You know, we're in a supermarket environment, it's very easy to pick up so many different lines of quick, easy fixes, and, and how we've always been um, programmed into what to buy and the 97% fat free and so it's all very well having a fat free cracker yeah. but I need to bung it up with something um, to sustain me for longer so I would have once again cottage cheese or make more of a meal on top of the cracker to last me through to the next um, you know snack or meal. It's learning now that you know it's making the whole meal so it's actually okay to have a little bit of fat and it's absolutely okay to have you know uh, you know peanut butter and all those things that we've always thought have been taboo. Um, some great success stories with um, some you know bigger people in store uh, but the biggest thing is their general well-being.
The biggest benefit I've got out of it is losing weight, losing that chunky middle-aged spread look that us ladies get. I've been involved with bulk foods for about 10 years here at Brookfield. A lot of the things that I've learnt through Eat for Keeps, it's something I can share with the customer, with the knowledge. We've got a good seed range here, they're really good to add to cereals. We're in the business of, of customer care and wherever we can add value to, to the customer, whether it be um, through their food choices, um, we're adding value to their shopping experience. So if our, our people can talk um, confidently about Eat for Keeps and um, steer them to the right food choices, it's, it's, yeah, it's a value added experience, it's a win-win. Well Melissa, and what you know now about Eat for Keeps, what sort of bars do you uh, choose? Well Lee, I'd choose this one, this yeah. one for me and my family. Mm -hmm. I'd choose this one because it's got nuts in it. So I'm halfway with Eat for Keeps. I've done 10 kgs and I need to do another 10, that's the goal. And um, being halfway there and, and using it with the family, it's been great. I, I've just got to push it that little bit harder and, and get to the end result. So what Eat for Keeps has taught me to you know, bring that in my home and, and use it with the family. So the family, as, as a family, we're making far better choices. By making some simple changes in the household with, with the eating, that we can um, see the benefits of that. So it's swapping a few of the key ingredients that we use on a regular basis and making some sensible changes. Um, we weren't looking to lose a huge amount of weight. Um, it was just that we'd gone a little bit heavier than we wanted to be. So we knew that just by making some small changes that we would get to the weight loss that we were really looking for, which was anywhere between the five and 10 kgs and it just seemed to come with a lot more ease than previously when I've attempted to do um, diets and that sort of thing. It was always a, a struggle and we tend to find that we'd yo-yo back up, whereas now that we've actually dropped down by between those five and 10 that we're just maintaining. Um, but the changes we've brought in are really for life now. So friend, what are some of the uh, muesli ingredients you're using these days? I'll add in some nuts, some almonds and some of the seed varieties that we've got throw in some natural muesli and then some rolled oats just from the cereal aisle. What do the kids think of all this? How do you, see, how do you get them to... Oh, they get to make their own cereal, pot yeah. of each of them on the bench. It's quite a fun way to get started in the morning. Oh, definitely, we spend a lot of time at work. <laughs> we eat a lot here, believe it or not, and, and we eat in groups. It's become a bit of a bond between the groups of people. Things like suggestions, you know, this is what I've done, this is the changes I've made. So it's really developed an awareness. So once they start to see the benefits, they really get hooked into the concept and then they just want to get better and better at better about how they learn how to do Eat for Keeps. The better that our customers and our staff feel about Brookfield New World as an employer or a place to shop, um, the more loyal they become and that's, that's a big advantage to us, to have loyal staff and loyal customers. I do see that people who have chosen to be on the Eat for Keeps programme, certainly um, they look healthier. We've had a lot of people lose um, a substantial amount of weight through exercise as well as the Eat for Keeps programme. It's like being young again really, I think. Like it's just like you can get in there and do lots of things that I never used to be able to do, you know. Yeah, anyone can do this, it's just about a few simple rules. It should be something in every workplace because everyone gets to understand. We all think we've been good, but it's understanding what is more sustaining. It's so much better when you're working with other people to create these changes and make it happen. So this is 60 kilos, the total goal of what I want to lose with Eat for Keeps. We're passionate about making these simple and practical concepts accessible to as many people in New Zealand and around the world as possible. Now if this did happen, and it did become an everyday message, and people actually learnt these skills, then we could really get some traction on these epidemics. I've just got to keep going what I'm doing and hopefully be around for a bit longer, you know? <laughs>